The oceans never cease to impress. When conditions are just right, the seas absorb man-made objects, such as this anchor. Exploring this underwater world also provides a perfect environment for exercise. And it's a great place to meet new friends, such as this NASA grouper named Wanda, who would regularly visit with recreational divers and documentary filmmakers off of Grand Cayman. Here is one species which is believed to be extremely hazardous, the stingray. Are these divers keeping still because of the danger? What would you do if you saw a southern stingray swimming towards you? Let's take a careful look at stingray anatomy. The ray doesn't have any teeth. Instead, it has small bumps it uses to break up its prey and grind their protective shells. From this standpoint, the only risk is getting a hickey, or if you don't tuck in your thumb, a harmless squeeze. Please excuse the language. A stingray can look fierce and frightening, especially when it makes eye contact. But rays are curious about other creatures and tolerant of human touch, and at times they seem to enjoy the contact. So what drives a stingray to come so close and interact with divers? The secret is in the palm of my hand, a little piece of squid. Watch the stingray's mouth. It knows I'm holding a snack and wants it. The stingray will follow my hand wherever it goes. But what about its stinger? It's retracted in a sheath at the base of its tail. It cannot sting at will. Most stings occur when someone steps on a stingray in the sand. The tail whips upward and a bar breaks off and usually penetrates the heel or ankle. Didn't a filmmaker die after being stung? How did that happen? Well, the common belief is that he was supposedly riding the stingray when it flipped up its tail and the barb broke off in his chest. When he pulled out the barbed stinger, it tore through his heart. He should never have ridden the stingray. The tail may brush against you as it swims by, but it doesn't sting you. Let's take another look at its anatomy. Holes next to the stingray's eyes are called spinnacles. They expel water from its gills. Keep an eye on the spinnacle opening and closing as the ray makes a close pass. A quick note, if you intend to feed a stingray, just remember to tuck in your thumbs and fingers. Oh, oh. 